Good morning, everybody. Mike Bakke, PrincetonTrader.com, with your Monday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, daily chart of the ES, and you know, look, the Bears uh, had their chances, and they they you know they tried to push it back down below that 1593 level, which we see come into play right in here, and you just you know 1593, 1594 held on one, two, three, four out of five days. And what that does is, is it creates a tradable floor. The bulls took advantage of that uh, over the course of the holiday, and we're seeing follow through uh, in the overnight today. They jumped over that trend line that I was concerned about. The trend line was a nice little fail uh, on the heels of the non-farm payrolls, and gave you about a 10, uh, 10 handle trade. Um, uh, on the short side uh, in the pre-market, uh, which is what we did uh, in the uh, in the subscriber room, but you know the bear uh, the bulls rather came roaring back, and we're seeing more here. And in looking at the chart, there's there's nothing to stop a test of uh, these highs here, uh, 1649. Uh, the 1646 to 1649 area is um, uh, my target area, if not for today. Uh, for at some point this week we're going to trade to those highs and test them. The issue then becomes does it create some kind of a double top or do we break through and start to go to work on the upper Bollinger Band there up at 1653 to, to 1660. If you're a bear um, you probably can't reverse it here. You've given up too much ground as it is. If you do get it to fail at 1646, what is likely to happen is to come back to test 1630, the high from Friday, uh, over the course of the week. Your ultimate goal is to try to get back and retest this middle band. Uh, but you know, as of as of trading right now, we are you're you're 25 handles above the middle Bollinger band. So. You know, we can talk about light trade, volume trade, things like this. You know, uh, on the fourth, you know, the morning of the fourth in Globex, which is kind of a nobody was home, kind of a melt up. You can talk about, you know, I was talking about Friday afternoon about how you know things had kind of thinned out and we were doing the same thing. But today's Monday, and it's a regular day, and the Bears are out of excuses, and they need to try to turn this around. I just don't think they're going to have any traction to do so until we get to 1646. Uh, we do have double pivots down at 1622.75, the daily and the 45-day. Uh, other than that, they're not really instructive. They're they're kind of rungs on a ladder. Um, uh, you've got the three-day at 1618, 20-day uh, at 1610 half, and the nine-day down at 1605. So, uh, but uh, 46 is the big number on my board. Okay, everybody have a fantastic Monday. Mike Bakke, PrinceandTrader.com. Check out the website. Check out the chat room. Uh, we're doing this stuff. Uh, we're doing it live every day, and we hope to see you there. I will uh, be back tomorrow morning with another webcast, everybody. Trade them well.